your latest news update from Western Mass News. Hello, I'm Mary Wilson, and here's your latest news update from Western Mass News. The United States has killed Al-Qaeda leader Ayman al-Zawahiri in a drone strike in Afghanistan. President Biden addressed the nation earlier this evening, announcing the results of the counterterrorism operation. He said Zawahiri helped coordinate the September 11, 2001 attacks that killed nearly 3,000 people and at one point acted as Osama bin Laden's personal physician. Zawahiri was 71 years old. An Agawam firefighter took the stand in the second week of the trial of Vladimir Zukovsky. Zukovsky, who's from West Springfield, is on trial in New Hampshire for the deadly crash in 2019, where prosecutors say he drove his truck into a group of motorcyclists, killing seven of them and injuring several more. The Agawam firefighter and paramedic testified about reviving Zukovsky with Narcan in an Agawam park in May of 2019, just a month before that deadly crash. Senator John Velas's office says the Amanda's Law bill was approved and is heading to Governor Baker's desk for his signature. The bill, named for Chicopee murder victim Amanda Plass, bans first responders from taking and sharing unauthorized pictures of crime victims. Plass's family says photos were taken of Amanda after she was killed and shared with other people in the community. I'm meteorologist Jana Brown. The check of your forecast as we head into Tuesday, the heat returns. Temperatures look to climb to near 90, but dew points will also be close to 70. So you are going to feel the heat a bit more. We'll have more clouds and sunshine throughout the day, but still some breaks of sun and most of the day will be rain free. However, later in the afternoon, an isolated shower or thunderstorm can't be totally ruled out. We'll have a healthy breeze coming in out of the south southwest with occasional gusts up to about 20 miles an hour. Now, Wednesday, the humidity comes down a little bit. High still getting up to about 90 and we'll have mostly sunny skies. Thursday, mostly sunny and dangerously hot with highs taking a run at triple digits across the lower valley. Mostly sunny, a, a first alert weather day for sure due to the heat. And then for Friday, a potential first alert weather day due to the threat for a couple of strong to severe storms and also heavy rain that could lead to some scattered flash flooding. Saturday, scattered wet weather highs in the upper 80s. We stay humid and unsettled through Monday, then a break in the heat and humidity. Stay with Western Mass News on air, online, and on our app throughout the day for breaking news, weather, and exclusive content.